guys, it's Sarah from All Coin Bus. Ladies, happy St. Patrick's weekend. I hope you all are with your friends and you'll have a minute to check out this video I made about car vertical and I hope your hungover won't be too bad. But let's get on straight to the topic, shall we? So I don't drive myself, but I can imagine that the purchase of a new car can be hard enough in regards of the amount of research that needs to be done and buying a used car, I mean, there has to be even more done because the vehicle might have had one or more previous owners, could have been through many accidents, like collisions, and the buyers never would have known about them unless someone told them the truth. Today, I'm gonna examine the case of Car Vertical, which is the first global and decentralized car history registry built on the blockchain. The project is intended to basically counterfeit unfair trade practices, mileage frauds and hidden damages especially. I heard someone say that it's basically like car facts but just on steroids. This company is aimed at eliminating the risks of manipulations with car's history data with the help of the top blockchain based solutions. So whilst researching I managed to find not only their website but also managed to find their one pager. I also managed to find a summary of a white paper which is really cool. We can find what problems does this solve in the real world and what sort of advantages does it provide. There are basically four major problems that still exist in the automotive industry. So we've got non-public data. We have the scale historical data with limited access. We have no ability to share data in between centralized databases as well as we have the used car owners and buyers not being aware of the full history of a car, which I have previously mentioned. So it sounds all good, but how does car vertical actually work? So it's based on Ethereum blockchain technology that takes information from as many centralized databases as possible and writes them on their blockchain. Car Vertical will basically be able to access police, Interpol databases, leasing, country registries, and many other databases to ensure that information about each car is as complete as possible. This way, the user can be 100% sure that the car was not tampered with, from all the information gathered, the company will be developing products that will enable the users to manage their car's registration, gather information about cars, run vehicles history reports, and much, much more. So I said that Car Vertical, they've had a lot of news recently and I thought they'll be worth mentioning. But before we do so, let's have a look on CoinMarketCap and see how it's doing. So all the coins, obviously, the market is not the best right now, not the best time to uh, look back on what's been going on, but it's important to and me doing this video is not anyway a professional financial advice. This is just my opinion and what I think about this project. I saw cool news coming up about them and I thought it's time to make a video about them. Uh, so they've gone down since the post ICO release. I mean, it happened to everyone basically, to every, every altcoin is currently down. And we need to stay positive and try not to think about it and keep on believing in the tech, which is what I do. You can get the car vertical on KuCoin with Bitcoin and Ethereum. They're also on IDX. Do you guys actually hold any car vertical? Do you guys know about them? Please let me know in the comments and let's get on to the news. So we're gonna start off with something that is by an old news on their Medium account that was 16th of December. Sorry for the old news. I know it's an old news, but I thought it's a good way to start it off. So basically, a few months ago, the company announced a partnership deal with GPSWOX, which is a provider of global GPS tracking solutions. At the moment, Car Vertical tech team is working on the hardware specifications for its installations units. It's interesting to see how they'll actually manage to make it work. This article is actually a very good read. I'm going to leave the link to it. Uh, as it's a good start off of what basically has been going on with Car Vertical, especially that they have released it before the ICO started. So let's have a look on their Twitter, which is 
my main source of information and we'll start off with the one that's in the thumbnail. So Car Vertical is proudly announced in the partnership with BMW Group, which was basically chosen as a partner for their pilot project. The Bavarian-based manufacturer has a solid base of connected vehicles already and what is more important is able to provide the infrastructure for efficient data exchange. Basically, both of the companies collaborate to create the first ever connected reports for the cars. I'm really excited about this project and I hope that they do succeed and it's a very good step towards implementation of what they stand for. Last but not least, Car Vertical becomes the newest member of Car Marketing Association in Europe which is a reputable club of used car market industry. As a member of CARA, CAR Vertical joins Renault, SEAT, Nissan, Hyundai, uh, Avis, Budget Group, Europe Car and other key players in the market. CARA is basically, for those of you who don't know, like a non-profit organization set up by various members with European background. This includes car manufacturers, fleet managers and car leasing companies, used car auction companies, used car data and services providers and companies that are active in the car marketing industry. So you can see how important this partnership is for Car Vertical to actually stand and match for what they came here for. I hope that they manage to implement their product sooner rather than later. So guys, if you're yet to follow me or our ladies on Twitter, I'm at Sara. We've got all own bus ladies Twitter account. We make the updates of our videos and we ask you guys questions. What would you like us to review next? Leave a comment below. I'm not out of ideas to make a video, but I always like to listen to what you guys are interested in. What's a hot topic right now? Cheap, hot altcoin and stuff. So let me know in the comments what you'd like me to review next. What's your opinion about Car Vertical itself? And if you're yet to subscribe to our channel, don't forget to do that. All combust ladies. We've got candies that made an amazing summary of what's been going on in the ICO hearing. I've made electronic videos, social send. Uh, Candice made an update, which um, is quite old news, we could say, because we know how quick things happen in the crypto, but I think it's good to listen to something that's only six minutes long and it's a quick summary. Also, we've got our Renee that made an advice for you guys on how to invest £1,000. She's not actually saying any cryptos, she's just giving her advice on how to approach a current market and how to make good decisions. So yeah, guys, I'll catch you guys later. Bye.